Hello guys, Gladiator Bricks here with a package from Brick Warriors. Now, whoop. Now, pretty much, I ordered a bunch of stuff from Brick Warriors, and Brick Warriors is a pretty good brand. I mean, I love the brand a lot. And of course, I will take stuff out. I might review something separate, like the, but I will open certain packs that. Are blind bags in front of you guys to let you go actually I might do blind bag openings first for for another video but I got several blind bags from there which I'm excited to open up which I will wait until I do a video for them so for those of you who are going to watch this movie first here's a bunch of blind bags that I'm gonna open of course, there are some things I'm going to go ahead and show you guys, like the custom minifigure that I got. This was, of course, $25, but it is a custom minifigure that was printed on an actual minifig minifigure. Which means, Brick Warriors makes custom minifigures with actual Lego torsos and legs. That's why they're so expensive, and they're custom printed. And of course, I bought a board game that Brick Warriors built, which I will do my own review on that. So, so, but I'll go ahead and tell you, I can't wait to try this game out, which I will not read this to you guys because I don't want to get copyrighted. But then again, I might actually go ahead. Hurry, hurry. The auction is about to begin. There are many gladiators from who, which to choose. Hey guys, look. First gladiatorial arena thing <laughs> included on my channel, Gladiator Bricks. All right, and it's a, actually I love the box on this thing. I mean, this I can't wait to review, but I'm gonna go ahead and wait to do another review on that. Here's what I ordered for some custom female minifigures. I'm gonna quickly open that. Uh, um. Okay, uh, um, where are you when I need your knife? Ah, oh, there he is. Apologies for damaging the package. There we go. <laughs> even put my name Sparks on this package. Oh my word. <laughs> nice. Uh, oh, don't want you damaging any of the products. Anyways. The armor is going, is, I ordered a bunch of them. They're female torsos for female gladiators. But I thought I could use this for a centaur figure, for my centaur figure to make her look a little more female. And of course I got three of them. So I could make multiple female characters. And I also bought this huge, this box of stuff. Which is basically several packets of different armor. Samurai armor. It looks like this is a samurai pack. Ooh, caveman pack. Um, pirate pack. Uh, I think that's supposed to be red coat pack. Ooh, female gladiator pack. All right. Let's see what else I get. Another guy with a gun. Oh, please let there be someone else. Another female gladiator. Another samurai. Another caveman. Black this time. Black and brown. Ooh, orc. Finally. An orc pack. Actually, you can see on the side of the package which characters I should be getting a lot of in here. As you can see, that's the first amount. There's a second amount. So, I'm actually hoping I get certain characters. Ooh, the Executioner. Philistine, or whatever his name is. A uh, sci-fi character. Other interesting warrior type. Another. Ooh, Knight. Um, actually, two types of helmets in that one. Aha! Barbarian. Another Barbarian. 
some sort of uh, two helmets in that one too. Let's see, another two helmets. Actually, these packs are going to be pretty cool to look through. I can't wait to put those. As for the box, I may actually put that box on display and put all my customs in this. Uh, sadly, it'll have to go on display, maybe behind me, right about hanging up on the wall up there. Oh, anyway, either way, huge shout out to Brick Warriors. They are pretty. They are in a pretty awesome company. I'm gonna go ahead and review the minifigure. So, Brick Warriors, this is the final round of awesomeness. A custom card of the character. I love this card. It's called the Cyborg. Let's look at the detail and the accessories that come with this character. Oh my word, there is too much I can point out is awesome about this figure. And it does say Lego. It is a Lego minifigure that they customized themselves. And I am worried. They got detail on the back? They got detail on the front? I mean, just dripping in detail, this figure is so awesome. I mean, I can't even stand a look. Uh, yeah, they kind of detailed the back a little bit too good. And, of course, she's got a katana and some sort of cool energy gun, which I've always wanted to get one of. Which, I just like the katana. I think I will give her my own person. I'm going to call her by Cyborg. But I'm going to have to think of a cool name. So in the comments, let me know what kind of name you think I should name her. I think I should, should name her something that sounds like a female robot would be called. And it looks like she's even got... The detail even looks like she's got flesh on her. That's kind of rotted off if you look closely. It looks like some of it's like she may have been like a Terminator, which I love that detail. Anyways, that's it for today, guys. Comment, subscribe, share this video. And please, if any of you get a chance to buy from Brick Warriors, do it. Trust me. In fact, if you can, just turn off this video, go to the Brick Warriors website, and just go there. It's awesome. All the different armor packs... Just their website alone is fun to look at. They got so many cool armors, which I would recommend to buy for your collection, just so you have custom armor packs. And of course, I've done a lot of talks on my channel about Brick Forge, Brick Arms, and lots of other companies. Brick Warriors has an amazing customer service, but so does Brick Forge. But Brick Warriors has it a little better. If they get your order wrong, they will try to repair that order. If one of your items were broken when they sent it in, they will replace that item, I think. I don't know yet, but I believe they would. They're that good of a cut they're that good of a business. They're actually a business. That's what's surprising. But they're awesome because they build and create cool looking armor packs and brick warriors you made one of the best board games I've ever found found in my lifetime and I will enjoy learning to play this game this video is for you guys to begin with and of course I will do a video where I unbox these because it might as well be a separate video where I can just so that this scary face does not show up. I should have covered this face. It must be very distracting to all you poor viewers out there. Actually, I think what's really distracting is that tiger up on my wall. That was drawn by my, was drawn by my grandma. She was an amazing artist. And, of course, that's all I care to talk about. Anyways, I love the... I'll have to throw away the old box, but... Actually, better get that those last bits out of there. I still hang these. I'm gonna hang these up on a. I'm gonna hang these up because they're awesome. I just like the. Actually, if you look at the packaging art for this one, 
very beautiful design. These are also custom minifigure designs you can buy on Brick Warriors. So to those of you who are thinking about checking it out, do it. Don't talk, just do it. Sorry. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and open one of these packs. Let's see, which one do I have? Uh-oh. I just found my newest favorite toy weapon to put in a Milego minifigure's hand. If I could just get this open. Just can't be ha this can't be possible. It just can't be possible. This is impossible, but it's so probable. It's a blunderbust. Look at that. It's an actual blunderbust for a Lego minifigure. All right. You know what this has just done to this haul? This has made me so happy. I'm going to have so much fun with stop motion animations for this weapon alone. And of course, there is a cool looking pirate coat, cool looking pirate sword, and actually two pirate hats, which both look pretty cool. If you look at them closely, one of them looks like a Napoleon Bonaparte hat, another looks like a actual pirate hat. Lego does make pirate hats, but those are not. But a Lego pirate hat, if I did a comparison, that's this is actually more accurate. This is more accurate. Anyways, those of you who are having trouble with the whole thing going on, I will continue to make videos on my YouTube channel for you guys out there who love Lego, who love customizing your creations and building. And I'm going to have to make up reasons to... S so... Do yourselves all a favor. If your job is closed, stay indoors and suit up for warfare.